the Splash World. Yo, what's good? Welcome to the Splash World. It's your boy Gunner. Today, I want to go into this topic on, on my beard journey. And, and possibly helping you out on your beard journey along the way. You know, we all could, you know, use a little help from here to there, a little hand, you know, you know, help a brother out. We gotta be our brother's keeper. All right, so today I wanna talk about a particular product from a particular company. I actually love this product and I see this product get a lot of flack and a lot of hate, but honestly, this product has gotten me by and when I first start growing my first beard, this is my second beard. This is seven, I wanna, no, 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 no. This is about nine months. This is about nine months of a beard. So, this product is a product that I found out about and I learned about and I actually tried to start using and I keep this in my regimen. The Scotch Porter Beard Balm. Okay, the Scotch, the Scotch Porter Beard Balm, and there's two different ones. There's a uh, the conditioning, which is the ones that that's the moisturizer one. Um, the thing is, I see this get a lot of flack because of the first ingredient. The first ingredient in this is water. Okay, look at it like this. When you take a shower, your beard gets wet. Your beard is gonna get damp. It's not like water can't touch your beard, right? But it's how people are using this product. Don't get me wrong. I totally understand that everything is not for everybody. Certain products are not gonna, you know, affect certain people the way they might affect others. You know, some people they might they might uh they they it might not work good for them. But hear me out. Before you just throw Scotch Porter away and it's water-based, you know, product, right? Try using it a little different than you may use it. Okay. Number one, don't use that much. It's a it, this it, it is a cream. It's a cream. You don't need a lot. Whenever you use, like, if, all right, so you see my beard, right? Just look at my length of my beard. You will want to use about this much. Now, you don't need a lot, okay? You just rub it into your hands. But don't just do that on a dry beard, okay? Do it, and it smells great. It's a it's a, it's a, a vanilla, creamy, you know, root beer type, you know, fragrance. I love the fragrance, okay? So, the thing is, fresh out the shower. Do this every day. Just if you have this product and you don't like this product, just try this like this. Do this every day for a week. Get out the shower whenever you shower, right? Your beard is gonna be damp. You can't stop, it's gonna be damp some kind of way. You know, it might not be saturated, but it's gonna be damp. Take a little bit of that, size it in, rub it into that damp beard. It's gonna make your beard soft, super soft, right? Pick it out, comb it out, whatever you wanna do. Then apply your beard oil. I'm gonna go over the uh, the Scotch Porter beard serum and how I feel about that also. But I would recommend that you apply a beard oil such as Grave Before Shave. Love that company. A beard oil, a good beard oil that doesn't have when you when you all right. So one thing about beard oils, you want simple almond oil, apricot oil. Jojoba oil, grapeseed oil, argon oil. You want it simple. If it has prime, if it has anything in there that you can't pronounce, sacrifice digging something, something strap extra. Don't use that. Just let that go. That's like bug spray. Don't even don't don't do that. Don't don't mess with that. But after you apply your beard balm, Scotch Porter beard balm, and it's not like regular beard balms. This is a very creamy substance. It's not like a, a hard, you know, a hard waxy type vibe that you gotta massage in to be like, that ends up like a, a oil. This is a cream and it moisturizes the hell out of your beard, especially when you apply it to a damp beard. So apply this to your damp beard, comb it out, let it sit for a second, and then put, a, put your oil in. Cause your oil is just sealing. Okay, this is, a, this is your moisturizer your oil seals in the moisture. 
it may dry you out. You may not like how it make, make your beard feel, but man, just hear me out. So I just wanted to give a shout out to Scotch Porter and the Beard Balm because this is a product that I use faithfully. The fragrance of it, um, it's... It's, it's, it's a great product, man. I understand everything's not for everybody. Some people have different, you know, grades of hair. You know, man, A to each his own. But I just wanted to give a shout out to Scotch Porter and the Moisturizing Beard Balm. It's your boy Gutter. Welcome to the Splash World. Glad I could help.